It was 2013, uh, we received uh, some uh, um, uh, AIS trucks of two vessels that were showing, uh, that was uh, indicating that they were fishing in our AZ and when we cross-checked with our license uh, list, uh, we couldn't find the, the two vessels. These were, uh, one was Sisha uh, plugged and one was Taiwanese plugged vessel. And we uh, contacted the, the, the two uh, authorities uh, and we received uh, very, again, this is, I think is also uh, through the, the, the trust and the collaboration that have, uh, have taken place within the Fisheye uh, countries. Uh, we had a very quick and positive response from, uh, from Seychelles that said, yes, but this vessel, according to our information have a license, and they actually sent a copy of, of the license. And when we cross-checked with our, uh, our records, that license wasn't actually issued by our, uh, our authority. And uh, we asked the, 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 the Seychelles uh, authority to provide us also with the list of other licenses, because then there might be others as well. Uh, of, of uh, uh, vessels of their flag that were licensed to fish in Tanzania. And then we cross-check the two, uh, the two uh, lists, the one we have, the official list in Tanzania and the, and the one that was sent from uh, Seychelles, and we managed to identify another eight vessels that were you know, showing licenses to, to the uh, Seychelles uh, authority while we don't have them in our record. Plus the one license that was um, uh, issued to or was sent from uh, the, the uh, Taiwanese authority. Actually, they, they also said that the vessel had a license and gave us a copy. So then we managed to see that these 10 vessels were actually forged. Uh, the licenses were actually forged and we have managed to take action. Uh, we have uh, identified the, the, the agent actually, we believe, conspired with one of uh, our own employees to produce this forged document. And we have suspended the employee, and we have, at the moment, suspended the agent from acquiring licenses. Uh, unfortunately, because we didn't have enough evidence to uh, uh, prosecute uh, the, the vessels, uh, we haven't done that. But the effect of, of that that vessels that weren't asking for uh, licenses before this particular case are actually now coming to, to get licenses. And uh, for example, if we compare 2013 to 2015, the number of new licenses that we have issued amounts to over $300,000. So uh, it's a significant amount.